Hi, I'm Sarah, and today I'm a guest chef at the Natural History Museum of Utah, and we are going to be making earthquake cakes. But before we get started on a delicious cake, let's talk a little bit about geology. Geology more or less is the study of rocks. Did you know that the earth is made up of layers? That inside, it starts with the inner core, outer core, mantle, and then the crust. On top of the crust, we have seven tectonic plates. These tectonic plates are shifting and moving slowly, and then when they slide into each other, sometimes this causes an earthquake. Earthquakes happen along a fault line, and in Salt Lake City, we're along the Wasatch Fault, which is the longest fault line in Utah. Utah has a geological record of over a billion years. A billion years is a long time. All right, well, let's get cooking. So to start off on our earthquake cake, we're gonna do layers of coconut. All the coconut right in there. And then our other solid pieces are nuts. You can use any kind of nut that you want. You could probably even use pretzels too. Spread it over here, nice and even. And then we're gonna do our next layer. This is our chocolate cake. All right, and now for our next layers. This has already been mixed together. Cream, cheese, butter, and sugar. We're gonna add these dollops right on top. Maybe this is kind of like our continents, making your own little earth cake right here. Add these. Definitely doesn't have to be pretty. Then our next layer, a bunch of chocolate chips. You could probably also get creative on this too. Doesn't necessarily have to be chocolate chips, but it does melt quite nicely. And it looks like rocks. Goes round. All right. And here we have our earthquake cake. And then we put it in the oven for about 30 minutes. For the sake of time, we already have a cake ready. So we have our earthquake cake, and this one is already cooled. So you can see it melted in, it changed shapes, kind of like the earth's surface, but it's ever changing, maintaining mountains and valleys. All right, should we try some? Mm, that's pretty good. <laughs> Make sure to check out our website for the recipes and some other delicious geology recipes too. And we have some more resources about exploring Utah and other geological features. Thanks.